I really love working from home. I love the peaceful environment. I love the time that you dedicate to focus. However, I'm very easily distracted. So it's Friday afternoon. I'm entrenched in work. I've got so much to do and I hear a tapping. Now my first thought is to shout downstairs and tell whoever that is to stop tapping. But no, the tapping is from out there. It's opposite my office, which is on a two-story townhouse. I've got an old tree and a lot of trees behind. And right in my view, same eye level, is the most beautiful, greatest spotted woodpecker. Now basically, me and Woody here, well, we don't see eye to eye, and that's because we like to play hide and seek. Well, he does anyway, and he's very good at it. But this opportunity is something that I just cannot miss. I've got my new Sony 200 to 600 lens, and I'm not afraid to use it. Gotta stop that, that window from begging because it keeps scaring it off. But yeah, what an opportunity. It's definitely trying to make some kind of a little home there. I think that's it's quite a deep hole now. And I don't think it's just searching for bugs. Because I have seen a couple on this tree before and they'll swing around and they'll pick at it and move and pick and move. But this one here is definitely looking like it is. It's trying to, you know, get a bit deeper. Around the back of the tree, there are some old woodpecker holes which are deep and they have nested in there. Really hope they have come back to make this their home right opposite my window. Perfect. <laughs> you can find the greater spotted woodpecker in most mature woods, or if you're very lucky, in your own back garden. I have been lucky enough to see woodpeckers on my bird feeders, but the second you turn your back to pick up a camera, they're gone. To have that opportunity to be able to film that, that at this eye level is, is just amazing. Normally you're looking up at them and you know, you get backlight and it's just, you know, it's not an easy thing. But as a, as a wildlife photographer or a videographer, you really want to be shooting at eye level with your subject. And this is just incredible. Anyway, back to work. <laughs>